so I'm going to review um, Bath and Body Works that I ordered in the mail. And I, this was the purchase three, get three for free. Um, so I purchased that and then some extra stuff. And it usually comes pretty quick, um, mail delivery. Um, I think it came within like five days, um, within ordering. Um, so once it shipped, I think it took about three days. Um, so I purchased some stuff for, um, men as well as for women. And I can smell it, of course, like with the box just opens, I can smell, um, okay, so I want to try to get it all out of the box and then we can move the box out of the way. It's a pretty box, so I like the, the checker tool. That's pretty. All right, so here we go. All right, the... The ones for the guys, I would not be opening and smelling or whatever because they're going to be a gift. So I will leave these be um, in terms of I, I won't open them right now. So um, Whiskey Reserve. And it says um, with hyaluronic acid, I mean hy hyaluronic acid, um, teak wood. I was trying to see if maybe the the notes, the fragrant notes, like okay, so teak wood has mahogany and black teak wood and lavender. It's for men. Whiskey Reserve has crisp apple, single malt whiskey, white oak, which also is for men. I really can't see how my camera is um filming right here so I'm gonna hope that it is filming okay that you guys can see everything this is the teak wood okay um let me see and this is for men it's the body spray um, so let's see classic flannel and the fragrance notes are fresh bergamot, patchouli spice and sweet amber. All right. Um, so those are the men's, the three for the men. And these are all for me. So, Frosted Coconut Snowball. And the fragrant notes are Frosted Coconut, North Pole Vanilla, Winter Fresh, Fresh, Freshia? I don't know how to say that. Freesia? I don't know. Snow Kissed Woods and Sponge Sugar. So, let me see. I don't want this video to take forever, but I do not know. I'm not very good at describing smells or like fragrance notes or whatever. This, um, like I said, I'm not very good at it, you guys. So I'll do my best. Um, it smells a little clean. This one, it, it smells a little clean. It does not smell overly strong. It's just okay. I don't smell it and go, oh my gosh, that smells so good. It's just kind of, um. A average nice smell for me so and I don't know if I have anything to wipe my hands with I didn't prepare myself very well for this video so all right so if you guys didn't see it very well 
don't know. Frost, frosted coconut snowball. There you go. They're pretty big. Like, I haven't had Bath and Body Works for many, many years. And then I just decided I wanted it all of a sudden. So, um, a thousand Christmas wishes. I'm not going to keep going over the notes. I feel like that's going to make this video just keep taking so long. So you guys, of course, can easily just look up the scents um, on the website. And they always have the fragrant notes listed. Um, so this is the, um, I want to say body spray. Body spray, whatever. I know this is um, kind of popular, the um, thousand, a thousand wishes, but I guess this is maybe the Christmas version. I don't know. I'm not sure. It kind of seems like it's something you have to let sit on you for a little while, like just sit for a while before you really get a feel for what you think about it. Because when I first spray it, I could really smell kind of like, I guess, the, the alcohol concentration or whatever. But And then after it sits, I start to get the really like the scent, which I don't know. Um, I think it's not as strong of a smell as I would like. And I cannot, like I said, I'm not good at describing smells, so I cannot, um, it has a sweetness. It has a sweet smell. Again, this is another one that I'll say is just okay. I don't like this top. It's, it's too, it's kind of loose for me. I don't like that. It's just, but it's fine. I just don't really like the top and whatever. All right, so what is this one? Winter Peach Marshmallow. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> okay, see, this is what I'm looking for. I'm looking for something that as soon as I smell it, it's like, yes, that's really nice. Yeah, this is nice, you guys. Like, what does this smell like? <laughs> I don't know because I'm not good at describing smells I can't tell you what it smells like um I'll tell you the notes in this one it's um velvet peach vanilla meringue and creamy jasmine I really really do like vanilla smells like you see I have the, the vanilla bean here um I love vanilla, so most things vanilla, I will probably like them. I think what makes this really nice, um, that it's mix. I think the vanilla mixed with the peach, I think that's what makes this a really, a really, really nice smell that I like. And then it has jasmine. So jasmine, I kind of like jasmine sometimes, so I, I kind of get, get why I do like this. Um, but so it's called winter peach marshmallow. And when I smell it, it does make sense that it's called, um, winter peach marshmallow. So, and, um, it is around Christmas. So these are, I think, I think this one is, is it available year round? Maybe not. I was thinking it was because it's vanilla bean. This, of course, I think these are just Christmas brands, I think. So, this one, I believe, I think this is available all year round, I think. Forever Red. Um, I will just go ahead and say the notes. Um... Fiery pomegranate, red peony. I don't. I don't know if I pronounce peony correctly. Um, rich, rich vanilla rum and oak wood. So, all right. Uh, all right. So. Mm. 
this is um a, a sexy smell like bedroom sexy type of smell and I don't know if I like it it's not bad but it's not me it would be like if other people like the smell on me, that would be what I was, what I would be like. I'd be like, okay, fine. If, if other people like the smell, then maybe I would wear it. But no, it's not one I would choose to go to. Um, like I said, it's a sexy smell for sure. And I think I remember it saying something like that in the comments, like, um, I don't think it says sexy, but I forget what wording it used, but wording that will remind you of, you know, like a sexy date night or something. Um, so like I said, I like the smell of vanilla, but okay, so this is supposed to have vanilla rum. I just, it's, it's, it's not my thing. Not my thing, just not my thing, so. All right, Vanilla Bean Noel body cream. Is that what they, body butter, they call it body butter, so. So let me see. Let me see if I can find somewhere to put it where I haven't put, where I haven't placed other lotion on me or whatever. Hmm, I'm surprised I don't really I'm not feeling this one in terms of the smell as much as I thought. I wanted the thick, the thick body butter, the, th the thickness of it. I wanted that for like my legs. So I will appreciate having the thick body butter for my legs. Um, and just, you know, just to have, so my legs are, you know, moisturized with the thick body butter for that benefit alone. Um, but in terms of the smell, it's not horrible, but it's, it's light. It's a light smell. And I, it's familiar. I use, when I used to, um, purchase Bath and Body Works many, 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 many years ago, I used to get vanilla bean lotion and I liked it a lot. So I can still smell that familiar scent of vanilla bean but it doesn't seem as strong or concentrated in this i don't know if it's because this is the body butter and it even says vanilla bean noel so maybe this is a little bit different from the vanilla bean lotion i used to get many years ago but I do smell a like a fam a familiar smell, like based on the vanilla bean that I used to get. Um, but it's not strong enough for me. The fragrant notes are fresh vanilla bean, sugar cookies, warm caramel, whipped cream, snow kissed musk. So. It's just not strong enough. That's the only drawback to me. Um, I would want it to be a stronger smell. But I do like it for the consistency of it. Um, I would even buy it again. But I would maybe even look for the body butter in some different smells. They didn't have a lot of um, options for the body butter so yeah um so my overall purchase i'm actually not very happy with so like i feel like i did not make the best choices um like i said this one i love great choice this one definitely not for me um yeah so that i almost want to say it is a waste but I don't know. Maybe I'll find someone to give it to. We'll see. 
And this one, this one is just average. It's okay. Um, so, you know, but I want great. I want like when you smell it, you're like, oh my gosh. Um, so I really don't want to go back and buy any more on top of all of this, but I just feel like I didn't get the, the satisfaction that I was really looking for that might make me go back and buy one or two more. So we will see what happens. Um, that's the review. Um, the Dow, this one, I'm smelling it again on my hand. It's not bad. It really isn't. Um, I can maybe even start to like it. Um, I, like I said, this one it just feels like you have to let it you have to let it sit for a bit, and then I think I just need to spray more on myself and I think I, I would like it so I feel like at least I got these out of it that I really like um this one definitely for the consistency the smell isn't bad I just think it's not strong enough but I'm not disappointed in buying this really um this I think I think I will come to like well enough this I love. This is just average. It's just like, well, if I need some lotion, it's fine. This I may not wear at all. And then we will, you know, I will have to see how these go when I gift them and if they're liked upon gifting it. So I don't know how these will go. But so that's it. And, um, Thanks for the review. I don't usually do um, these type of reviews, but I just wanted to review the Bath and Body Works. And that's it. And thank you guys for watching.